know why you just oh, yeah. finished your first rehearsal? Yeah. What does it feel like? What is the atmosphere in the arena? It's amazing. It's really empowering being on that stage. Yes, I see. So you are one of the youngest participants yeah. this year. Do people always talk about you about that? How do you feel? No, I, yeah. You know, it, it, it comes up, but I, it's, it doesn't change anything really. It's just an amazing game race opportunity at such a young age. Yes, um, so you've probably taken music really early? Yeah, yeah. I've been, uh, in, uh, I've been doing this for about 10 years. Uh, I started in musicals when I was uh, 11 and started doing music when I started doing musical stuff when I was 9. And yeah, just, yeah. Yeah. And you are the songwriter? Yes. I'm the I'm backing up this. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. How did you come up with the idea for this song? I just sat at the piano and when I write music I usually just sit down at the piano and play. And I don't know, I don't overthink or plan. The music just somehow comes. It's so all feeling? Yeah. It's all feeling. Absolutely. Yeah. So it was something I was feeling that day. Comes out in the song. You know that if everyone that we meet has has a story and has pain hidden beneath them, and I was thinking about that. Okay, um, I'm from Bulgaria, yeah. and I watched a video message you sent to our friends. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and you mentioned that you've been to our country. Yeah. So, what did you do there? And uh, <laughs> would you like to come back again? Yeah, I would like to come back again because I only went to Sunny Beach. But I didn't get to go to the capital because it was a, it was a graduation trip. You know, when we graduate, we go to uh, uh, Sunny Beach, and I went there, uh, you know, to uh, you know party and have a good time. And I, I went skydiving uh, in, Bul in Bulgaria, and that was the best. Like that was one of the best experiences was of my life. Was it terrifying? No, it was really terrifying. But yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but it was a, it was the best feeling uh, ever when you get on the plane and when you free fall. Thank you. Um, I see that you sing a lot of songs by the other participants on yeah. here in the interviews. So how are you going to keep your voice out? Uh, just yes, you might get uh, sick or tired. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, it's, it's just a little part, you know. It's actually better to sing than to talk. Like, talking is the worst thing you can do for your voice. So, yeah. We actually really, no. like, we actually really like the Bulgarian song. Yeah. We met the artist on our, the free parties, and it's, it's personally one of my favorite ones. Yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you. Um, I suppose I won't make you sing right now. But, uh, we can always sing. We can. We can yeah, I mean, game. Yes, yeah. just a quick, quick game, yeah. which is called hashtag your child choice. Okay, let's do it. Ari. That's great. Um, and I'll make you choose between the following things. Okay. The sunny beach in Bulgaria uh, or a nice place in Iceland. Uh, um, wow, I'd say a nice place in Iceland. <laughs> okay. Um, puppies or babies do very cute things? Pu puppies. <laughs> okay. Um, that, that's understandable. Um, would you rather stay one year in the wild jungle or travel the world for a year? <laughs> Uh, I travel the world for a year, yeah. But uh, wouldn't you like to be in the jungle and to, to be on an adventure there? Yeah, you know, it's also nice to travel the world. I mean, things, things can eat you. Yeah. Jungle, right? yeah. Um, <laughs> then you said you want to eat, so sweet or salty food? Uh, sweet. Okay, and finally, an opera concert or a metal concert? Uh, an opera concert. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm a classically trained singer. I, uh, and I, I listen to a lot of classical music. That's so great. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you, thank you so much.